Hi, and thanks for joining me. Something slightly different for you today. The film you're about to see was made by me in July 2013 when I visited the Newport Transporter Bridge in South Wales. In the whole world there are only eight transporter bridges remaining and not many were ever built. Newport Transporter Bridge is one of three that remain in England. The other two are at Middlesbrough which is also known as the Tees Transporter Bridge as it crosses the River Tees and there is another one in Warrington which crosses the River Mersey. Newport and Middlesbrough have been restored but the Warrington one hasn't. The Warrington one is unique in its way as it was a rail transporter bridge. It used to take railway wagons across the river as opposed to road traffic. There is a friends group, Save Warrington Transporter Bridge. They have a Facebook page which you might be interested in having a look at. When I visited Newport I was able to clamber all over the bridge. You can go up the towers either end and walk across so what you're going to see is actually quite interesting. All three structures are listed. Newport is Grade 1 listed and Warrington and Middlesbrough are both Grade 2 star listed which puts them in the top 5% of listed properties. The film you're going to see was made by me for me. It was never intended for a much wider audience. There's no narration on it and I haven't added any. I have obviously adapted it at the start to show you where the bridge is located and so forth but the main body of the film is unaltered and as I filmed it. Now what was the transporter bridge for? Well it crossed the River Usk in South East Wales and gave access to the Orb Steelworks which were on the other side of the river. The bridge opened in 1906 and it was built with towers on each bank of the river with a massive boom running across between them. The boom supported what is known as a gondola which was the carriage that took vehicles and pedestrians across the river and that is slung underneath it at road level and you'll see that in action in the film. Now at the start of the film there are a lot of images which flash by very quickly. This is the way I used to introduce a lot of my films for my benefit. It just gives you a taste of what's to come they're not images designed for you to look at and linger. <laughs> so you may be thinking, well, that flashed by very quickly. But what you see, you will see in the film in more detail. So just to recap, Newport Transporter Bridge, it is actually the oldest bridge of the three that remain in England. It was built to cross the River Usk to give access to the Orb Steelworks. It's been refurbished several times in the last 30 years. It's still a working bridge. You'd need to check when it is open if you wanted to travel on it and also check whether it is open to walk across the top because in poor weather conditions I would imagine that it's closed. I went there in July on a lovely sunny day and it was quite a climb up to the top of the tower I have to say <laughs> but well worth it some lovely views from the top <laughs> I hope you enjoy watching it is following my water related themes when I'm not showing narrowboat related activities <laughs> I tend to show something connected with water if I can see what you make of it
many thanks for watching. I hope that was a nice diversion from watching usual cruising videos. It's quite a unique sort of bridge and we are lucky to have three of the remaining eight bridges in England. So if you do get the chance to see any of them, either at Newport, Middlesbrough, Warrington is a little bit more difficult, I think access to that is not so easy. They are quite a prominent feature on the landscape. If you are in those localities and get the opportunity, it's well worth taking a look. So, as usual, all remains for me to say is look after yourselves. Please do subscribe if you haven't yet done so and click the bell to receive notifications of future videos. Take care. Until next time, bye for now.